I have a bag of empties, but I just put them on the vanity in front of me. So we can go through them together. I can show you what I've gone through in this past month. Um, I've got it broken up. I've got makeup, hair, skin, body. I think that's it. Uh, so that's what we're gonna go through. Sunscreen, I went through the Summer Friday Shade Drops finally. I do like it, I would repurchase that one. I had another sunscreen. I try to do them in order, but it doesn't always work out that way. Uh, Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. It was just a little one. Um, it worked. I've got a bunch of primers that I want to go through, and I want to try that new one by um, Patrick Starr, the one size um, for sweaty people. Uh, say Star Glow. I've tried the Sun Glow. I don't like it. I do like the Star Glow, and I'm really looking forward to trying the pink one. But since I'm going to Sephora at the end of next month, I have not purchased it yet because I'm really hoping they have samples there so I could try it that way. But yay, I finished it. And I think I got that one at last year's Sephora. The NYX Plump Right Back um, with electrolytes because it's what plants need. It is the Plumping Serum. I do like that. Uh, I think I might have purchased one. I'm not sure though. But again, I've got a lot of primers that I'm trying to work my way through. Lip stains for me work out so good. And then I could put like the lip oils on top or lip balms on top. This one by Milani, the color fetish is amazing. I think I have them in pretty much every color. I don't know what color this one is though. It's that color. If you could read it, I can't read it. Um, but they're all beautiful. Like I love them all. And you would think that it, it goes like this for some reason, but it's not, it goes like that. So I keep them in my bag. I'm, I'm doing a live. What's up? Are you gonna finish your iced tea from a counselor? Yes, I will. If you wanna put it in a cup with ice, I would appreciate it and bring it to me. Went to McAllister's for lunch today with a client. Um, I just found this again, the Brow Genius from Anastasia and I finished using that up. And then what I do at the end is I try to pour it out and there was none left. So this is empty. It's pretty, it's a nice weight container. Um, I have been using the brow serum and the lash serum and oh my gosh, wait till I share with you my next lash serum. It is from Style Korean and it is amazing. It's so nice, it's so easy to use. And it's better than the ones I've been using that you paint on. Um, the Sephora uh, Brow Gel, right? I think it's the Brow Gel. Made in Italy, yeah, Tint and Volume Brow Gel. I do like it. And I believe I have, yeah, I have another one in here that I'm using, another Sephora one also. I've got a few different brow gels. The Tower 28 Mini Mascara, is this the black? I don't know if this one's the black or the Drift. Um, either way, it dried out. I do like it. I have so many mascaras though to go through. If I try it and it's like clumpy, I just get rid of it. Um, hi, what is this brand? Hymish, this is one of the Korean beauty ones. I really like this one, it's really nice. Uh, and then I have the Grande Brow Brow Enhancing Serum. So this is another brow one because I ran out of that one then I used the other one. It's been a month, month and a half. Okay, hair products. The Living Proof Full Shampoo and Full Conditioner. I really liked it and so I purchased the full size, the giant size, and now I wanna purchase the Ghost. Um, Here you go. Thank thought you. I wasn't going to do it, man. I got an iced tea, too. It's half and half, sweet and unsweet. Ah, McAllister's has the best tea. Except I like straws, but that's okay. I'm not going to complain too much that he can hear. Uh, do of the Gods Amalfi Gold. This came in one of the, I'm going to say Allure. It is olive and argan oil. It's a hair serum. So if I, I've tried doing where you wash uh like every other day every third day i can't do every third day i could do every other day sometimes but that means that the second day i'm just pulling it back um and then before i wash it that night i'll put something on hair oil serum scalp serum you know uh, i did finish up the k18 leave in at molecular repair i have another one i'm working through i do like that i actually need to use that You're supposed to use it what the first four times four or six times and then go to once a week so, okay. Uh, Bumble and Bumble B6, or BB, sorry. Bumble and Bumble, hairdressers, invisible oil. I don't like this. I might be using it wrong. I don't know. 
Um, I've had a couple little samples of it and every time I'm like, I'm gonna try this, people like it. I think it's just for, my hair is fine. There's a lot of it um, sometimes, um, but it's not coarse, right? So if I get, if, if I have something for coarse hair, like my son has coarser hair, my husband has coarser hair. So I try to pass it on to them. So that might be what the problem with this is. It might be for hair that's coarser than mine. And then K18 Molecular Repair Hair Oil. I use that up too. And I have a whole bunch of hair oils. I do like hair oils. And look how good my hair looks right now. Right? That's that ghost, man. Okay. Body. I had this for my trip. This is the Sol de Janeiro Boom Boom Body from Mesa Oil. I do like this. I actually might keep that and refill it for when I go to... Actually, no, this didn't even last me five days. I think this lasts me three or four days. Um, so I'll just bring a bigger one when I go to California. This smells so good. I really like this. Nativa Spa Rosé Replenishing Body Lotion. They have another one, a quinoa one, that I've got a couple times from Allure. I really like it, but I can't find it at Alta or Sephora. Do you know where they sell this? Because I do like it, and I wouldn't mind purchasing a full size, except I can't find it. I don't want to just order from the company. I'd rather get it with you know the company I already shop with so we have the tropic glow firming whipped shea butter body butter and then the moisturizing shave oil and the firming body oil they're not a dupe for boom boom but it's on that wave right so I, and I do like them they do smell good um, I love the shave oils that's all I use now for shaving are these shave oils I love body oils so I've been using up another one of those and I'm using the Costco knockoff right now for the Boom Boom, and it does not smell like it at all. But this smells really good. I do like that. And I think I have a sugar scrub in there right now, too, from that same brand. Um, the Good Molecules B5 Hydrating Body Serum. I do like the body serums. I think I have one of these every time we do one of these. But I've been doing the body oil, so I've been using the serum as much. Uh, the Jeffree Star Body Lotion Espresso Shot Body Lotion. It's little, um, it's good, like it smelled good, but with this pump, it was hard to get out. And even now, like it's a little bit left, but not a ton. It does smell good. I like the smell of coffee. I don't like the taste of coffee, but it does smell good. This was OMG amazing. Slay and Fire and Not Ohio. Um, Bejo's D Soul, it had so much good smell in it except it's only this size and now they don't have them out anymore. So maybe next summer they'll come out with them for realsies. Um, but I really, really, really like this. It smelled so good. I burned through it pretty quick. Sweet Spot Labs pH Balancing Intimate and Body Cleanser. This came in a sample from Alta, I think it was. So it was in my shower and I got it used up pretty quick. That is it for body. Everything left, I believe, is face stuff face skincare and all the goods that go with it. So what do I got? Everything. Let's start with cleaners. This is one of my favorite cleaners. I use this in the morning because this is what I keep in my shower. It is Collagen Clear Estee Derma Peptide 9 MDP from Metapeel. I thought this was the full size. And then I have some shorties for when I travel. Um, it's not the, this is the medium size. I have one that is way, way bigger. This is 120 mil. My new ones are 300 mil. And I just got two of them in from Style Korea because this is great. Like, look how good my skin looks. And I took everything off of it already. This is no makeup on. I did my skincare like three hours ago for the evening because our HVAC needed changing and it was so hot in here. It was hitting 80 degrees in the house and I was about dead. So... You know, I, I showered and I figure I'll jump in the shower tonight to wash the sweat off of me. So that's my favorite for morning. For evening, this is what I like, is the Tokobo. This is the Calamine Pore Control Cleansing Oil and the Tokobo Coconut Milk Pink and Mineral Clay, uh, well, Coconut Clay Cleansing Foam, right? So I... First cleanse, second cleanse. I love this. And I tried using some other stuff. My face started breaking out and I was like, I'm going back to that. So I just got two backups of each of those in plus two backups of the white and red cleaner that I really like. I got that too um, because I really like those. 
um, they're super cleaners. Also like this, this Kate Summerfield Exfoliate Intensive Exfoliating Treatment. This lasted, I think about three uses, two to three uses, and it feels really good on. I would love to get a bigger one of these. They're wicked expensive. So we'll see maybe if they come on sale. Are they, I think they're at Sephora. Are they at Alta too? I don't know. Um, but if they come on sale, I'll definitely buy some of that. Uh, cleansers. Oh, here's another one I had. This is from Tony Moly. Uh, it's lemon. It's clean dew lemon foam cleanser. I did like this one also. I like the other ones better, but I did like this one. And that one's hard to find. I just saw he has an aloe one that's on sale at Style Korea, but I haven't purchased that one yet. Okay, so that I think is all the cleaners that I have out. Next up, let's do toners and such. So the Inua 77% Heart Leaf Soothing Toner. I have a couple more of these because they were just like, with everything, you, you got one. So I have, I think, three of these still in there. And what I did with this, I didn't use it up. I actually made it into toner pads. So I kept one of these and I put these toner pads in it, right? So that I can just take it and I can wipe it on. Apparently you're supposed to soak your cotton rounds before you toner yourself uh, with water or with toner. So I know there's people who are, you know, like, oh, you use too much. You're not supposed to be using all that. Um, you know, this is just a waste of product and a waste of paper and cotton rounds and everything else, but it's better for your skin, supposedly. Don't know how true it is, but that's what I heard. This stuff is flipping amazing. How this comes, it comes in a little squatty container like this, but shortened, about half that size, with tweezers in the lid. And it's a bunch of cotton rounds, little cotton balls, right? Like little tiny dental cottons. And this, and what it is, is the AHA2, BHA2 blemish treatment with PHA, zinc, PCA, and allotonin and hyaluronic acid for sebum control, blackheads, and whiteheads. So what you do, you open up the cotton rounds, you open up this, you pour this in with the cotton rounds and it just soaks in there. And then when you need the cotton rounds, you can pick it up with the tweezers and you dab it. Like I had a little pimple right here, so you could dab it right there on that little pimple, right? I have some discoloration around my nose because that's usually in any place out that I feel like I might be getting a breakout or feel a breakout. So you can dab it everywhere. These are amazing. I've got the one in there and I have, I think two, maybe three on standby because it's just that good. Like get that. Because I was using the Kiehl's acne thing. This is way cheaper and way better. Um, <laughs> that's a moisturizer, that's a mask. Okay, here's another one. A bib heart leaf essence. I did like that. I'm on my next one of this. Um, it is nice, right? I like the heart leaf. Oh, I just told you about the Kiehl's. This is the Kiehl's one. Um, it's Kiehl's Truly Targeted Acne Clearing Solution. It's a 2% salicylic acid, but that's the only active ingredient is the 2% salicylic acid. So I was like, okay, if this is 30, what can I get K-Beauty wise? Is that is it a half ounce for 30? Is that the going price or can I find something better? But I do like this and I do like Kiehl's. Uh, moisturizers, here's a little, I brought this to the beach with me to use up. It's a little, excuse me, Drunk Elephant Be Hydra Intense Hydration Serum. I think it lasted me two days, maybe three, and I was there for five. I uh, also brought these to the beach, or this to the beach. Uh, vitamin C ceramide things from Elizabeth Arden. I had three of these. Oh, here's the other ones. Okay. Well, here's the other one. Yeah, here's the third one. I know I had three of them. So this is hyaluronic acid. This is retinol. And this is the ceramide capsules, radiance renewal serum. So I think they had, I don't know, under 10 uh, of the little capsules in each one. The issue is during skincare, your hands get all wet and gross, and then it's hard to pop that top off because it's the little capsules. Uh, favorite training treats right now is Happy Howie's, or is it Hungry Howie's? Not the pizza, the training treat. It comes in a little roll, and um, our team will sit and slice them up so we have them. That freeze-dried liver and their kibble all mixed together into like a trail mix. That's what I like. But yeah, so I used up all three of those. Uh, moisturizer, moisturizer. Here we go. I used the L'Oreal Revitalift. I want to purchase this. 
It came as a sample. I'll use it if it comes as a sample, but I'm not gonna purchase it. Uh, Mary in May, Marine Collagen. I did like this. I have another one that I'm working through also and another collagen that I'm doing right now to see um, what I feel. Uh, Medicube Vitamin C, 14.5% Deep Vita C Ampule. So these come this size. It lasts about a week and it comes with little droppers. So you put the little dropper in and you use it. And then whenever it's done, you switch the dropper to the next one and you cap it up and it's gone. Also from Medicube, Deep Vita A Retinol Serum. So that I used up also. <laughs> oh, here's another one. This one, it came off. This is Mary and May. It's a Blackberry Complex ampule. So I used that up. Oh, here's another cleaner one. The La Roche-Posay Lipicar Gentle Foaming Cleansing Oil. So I brought this to the beach for the first step in the double cleanse just to use it up because there wasn't that much left. Everyone know this. Glow Recipe Nice and Mine. Dew Drops. I have not tried the... Glow drops, the bronzing drops, because I don't bronze. I don't like bronzing. I don't need to bronze. I don't get it. And I live in Florida. Um, cream, 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 cream. Haru Haru Wonder Black Rice Hyaluronic Ton Toner or Tonic. Um, I got a big full size. I did like that for the little bit that it was. I knew I had another sunscreen. The Kiehl's Better Screen UV Serum. I do like this. Um, however, I did get it in my eye and then I couldn't get it out of my eye and that annoyed me. Um, but I used up that at the beach. Oh, lip products. I used up two of these. This is from CNP Laboratory Propolis Lipserin. And I'm on another one in there. I do like it a lot. I also love this one. Here's another lip one. It's the Laneige something. And this is me finishing up. Oh, yeah, the lip treatment balm. I think it's all with the weird little stick thing that comes with it. But, oh, my gosh, it feels so good. And I knew I had one more use, so I was saving it for you guys. Look how shiny my lips look. Like, I really like this so much. Uh, it just it feels really great. Hello, gamer girl. Uh, Magic Eye Rescue from Charlotte Tilbury. Use that up at the beach also. I do like her eye cream. I like her products. Um, they work out really well. I did not like this eye cream. I haven't liked this brand yet, Dime. Do you guys like Dime? I don't like Dime. So I took the eye cream and I just used it on my body because why not? Just used up like the packaging feels luxe. It feels nice and heavy, but the product is just meh. Same with this, the Gold Fountain MD Energetic Eye Cream. I used up on my body too because I didn't like it as an eye cream. So, no. Partic and I've got a lot of eye creams that I'm going through and that I'm trying and I do like. Oh, here's another one of those vitamin Cs. I'm putting them in the bag afterwards. Uh, Haru Haru Wonder um, Centella 4% TXA Dark Spot Go Away Serum. I did like that also. I, I don't have a lot of dark spots. I've got a couple of them, so I do try to hit those up. Um, stop whining. Yeah, it's not that bad, but... I'm Aloe Skin Calming Instant Mask Pads. So this is empty, right? So this is one, you can see it has the little uh, tweezers up there in the lid. Some of them will have like a little tray that you have to lift out. I like this so much. And you could put the cotton rounds in there and do whatever. Just be careful when you close it so it doesn't fall in. Uh, we might do this, I'll put this aside. We can do it for, um, even for dog ear wipes, right? So I'll put the cotton runs in there and soak it with ear cleaner for the dogs. And then we have something like this ready for them. So glad I caught you live. I have EDS and POTS. That's how I found you on my For You page. That's awesome. Okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I got diagnosed when I was 19. Um, so I've been living with it for quite a while. I just got officially diagnosed with the EDS a few years ago. Because I was like, I think I have it. And he's like, yeah, of course you do. And I was like, oh, okay. The doctor told me I was double jointed when I was born. So I tell Rich all the time. I'm like, I'm pretty bendy. And I am. Uh, the Medicube Collagen Glow Booster Serum. I do like this. It's like, jun, 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 and rub it in. I do like that. I've got another one that I'm using, and I have another one in standby. Belief uh, True, Cre True Cream Aqua Balm. I like the creams more than the gels. 
I don't care much for the gels. They don't do much for me. Having said that, this one I did like. Mary in May Vegan Calendula Peptide Ageless Sleeping Mask. I do like sleeping masks, so I'll do my skincare. And then before bed, I will slather stuff like this on and go to bed. Or like the collagen wrap mask and go to bed with that or just a heavier moisturizer. So this was more of a gel. You can kind of see some of it's left. And that's pretty awesome. I really like it. I also used up the Pharmacy Honey Halo Ultra Hydrating Ceramide Moisturizer. I got this at Sephora last year. So hopefully I'll get more this year when I go, when Tara and I go the end of next month. Um, I do like it a lot. I love that it has the magnetic lid. So that sticks to it uh, and it smells great. It is a heavier moisturizer, so I would do this before I'd go to bed at night. Um, you can also use this, I had depotted into here. It's the In Beauty Project 10 in 10 Moisturizer. Uh, I would do this before bed or give it to Sam when she came down. This one, this Claire's Rich Moist Soothing Cream is amazing. I really like it. So if I'm gonna do my um, Medicube, my bzz, 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 bzz. look, I do skincare stuff. Um, that's a good one for me to put on. I'll put on a gel and I'll put that on and it just feels so good going into the skin. Uh, Laneige, I used another of the Cream Skin Pepti uh, Sarah Peptide Toner and Moisturizer. I have some here with a pump and I have some in the bathroom and a spray. I love both of them. They're amazing. This, I just got a refill in today. That's part of the paper. That's my South Korea, two of the orders. This is Jumiso Snail Mucin 88 and Peptide Facial Cream. I loved this. I put it on before I do my uh, medic, medical Medicube thing, do, 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 my wand. And I really liked it. It lasted a while. It felt really good on. I am on the Exosome train. So these are the Medicube One Day Exosome Shot 2000. I think they're both the 2001. I think they only have two different levels. So I have those. I'm doing a Riedel one now to see. And like I said, my skin looks amazing. So I'm very happy with those. This I've had for probably a year in my shower. Do Fuji Fuji Collagen Whip Vitamin Mask from Dew of the Gods. I did not like this. It would, I would use it. You can see the color that it, well, it was that color. It's all cleaned out now. You can kind of see a little bit on there too. But it was that, uh, neon teal color so i'd put it on my face i'd get one of my disposable face towels i'd wash it off afterwards i'd wash my face with a normal cleanser i'd come out and i'd toner pad it and i'm still getting blue off i don't like that at all i don't like that so i would not repurchase that eight saints uh, eight like number not like num, num, num. i'm hungry Eight Sates up the anti-aging anti night cream, hyaluronic acid, niacinamide, and peptides. I like this. Um, it came in, I don't know, one of my boxes. Uh, but it was only a couple, maybe four uses. Um, but I did this in the evening before bed. This is one of my evening moisturizers. Here's the Haru Haru Wonder Suntella Phyto and 5-Peptide Concentrate Cream. I would use this before the magic wand. Um, there's not a ton in here. I, I guess, well, 30 mil, one ounce. So it's about half the size of what I'm used to. I did like it. I did use it all up. Would I repurchase it? Yes. Especially if it was on sale. Dr. Jart Plus Intensive Soothing Repair Cream. Eh. It's still an eh, even if it jumped out of my hands. I finally used this up. This was another Sephora gift from last year. Innisfree Pore Clearing Clay Mask with Super Volcanic Clusters. I had just a little bit left for Rich to do because he's got his beard, so he only needed like half of a face of it. But I had him do a mask. I liked it a lot. I would definitely repurchase this. Especially, I like the clay masks. I feel like they'll clean all the gunk out of my pores easy. Last, yeah, it is the last two items I have, is the... A Beale Royale Advanced Youth Watery Oil. I like a face oil. I have the Summer Friday now. I'm not as wild about it, but again, my skin's looking really nice. So um, this was nice. It was a watery oil. Like there, there, and you can see the little specks that were in there. I don't like the dropper. The dropper's annoying. I'd rather have a pump. 
I liked it. I would not spend what it is though. It would have to be on sale. So this was on sale, it was part of a deal. It was this, it was this, which is their eye cream. Yeah, eye cream. And it was this, their lip balm. I think it might be a pH lip balm. But it was all three of those. On sale at Sephora after Christmas, well, it was their Christmas deal, right? So it was after Christmas deal. So it was on sale at a huge discount. Plus I got, I think my 20% off. So I bought it. It wasn't as expensive as what it could have been. I think all three of them were less than the price of this would have been. Um, what I don't like about this pack, this was easy to open because of the angles. I did like that, but I don't like whenever they have stuff up in the rim like this, because it's really hard to get everything out. You can still see there's still some left in the corner. So I didn't like that part of it. Um, but I did like that it was easy to open and close. And then this, you know, like it works. I liked it. I just like other stuff more. Unless it's on a really good deal. Right. Sometimes you have to. Okay. But that's what I've gone through this month. Thank you for joining me. I usually do a video. And then I edit it a lot. Then I upload it. And I figured this way I could just go live and talk to y'all. But I'm hungry now. So I'm going to go get something to eat to go with my iced tea. Have a good evening.